Hi everyone! In the last video, I said to look at photos we took of the sun and draw the position of the sun in the sky at five different times of the day. Did you draw a pattern like this? How does this pattern compare to the pattern that you made with the flashlight? You can pause the video to think about it or talk about it with somebody. The pattern I recorded from the photos is similar to the pattern I made with the flashlight. The sun rises low in one part of the sky, gets higher in the sky, and sets in a different part of the sky. That's similar to the pattern we made with the flashlight. So let's go back to my first question. Why was my shadow shorter at lunchtime and longer the next morning? What do you think? Look at your drawings of the sun. Use the model you made. Pause the video to think about it. I bet you have some new ideas compared to when we started. In the morning, the sun is low in the sky. When we model the morning, it makes a long shadow. In the middle of the day, the sun is high in the sky. When we model the middle of the day, it makes a shorter shadow. Make a prediction. What happens to a person's shadow in the evening? Pause the video to make your prediction. Did you say a person's shadow would be long again? You may have also said that the shadow would be the opposite direction compared to the morning. Well, it was fun learning about shadows in the sun with you. Keep observing, asking questions, and making models to figure things out. See you next time.